Hey y'all, I Rick Sky here and I've got my shoot list and you know keep asking the questions and I'll try to address them within upcoming videos. It's what helps me find field topics for uh, for the Mavic Air 2 and other drones. I'm hot and sweaty because I've been doing a ton of field tests, running around, hopping over the landing pad and a whole lot more. Check out my other videos, subscribe, uh, youtube.com forward slash Sky and ring that bell icon to be notified when I post all my videos. And uh, within this video, I'm gonna address what is that line that appears within the DJI fly app before, I mean below and, uh, and above the top of the DJI fly app and the bottom of the DJI fly app. So within this video, I'm gonna show you what that bar is and how to make it appear and tell you what it means. So let's see, I'm gonna hit my little screen record here so I can show y'all um, I can show you all the app view here. See, I'm just waiting for that to fire up, man. None of these shows are scripted, so you know it is is what it is. I want to keep uh, I want to keep everything honest and and you know give y'all a true uh, snap uh, a true visual of of what it's like, you know, flying a Mavic Air 2 and other drones. Check out my other drone videos. So I'm recording the screen now. That's fine and dandy. I'm going to go into DJI Fly app, and we're going to show you what this is. I've got low battery. I've been flying a few flights already. I'm going to click record. I'm filming in 4K 30. Take off, obviously in a safe and responsible location. So here's what the lines are. So notice now at the top of the app and the bottom of the app, there's no lines. Watch what happens when I come close to myself. There's a line at the top. And what that is, is obstacle avoidance. Now again, obstacle avoidance, at least at the time of filming this, does not work in sport mode. And never assume that it works to be safe. But when it detects an object, if it is functioning, you'll see that line. So how cool is that? Now I'm gonna do it in reverse. I'm gonna make it show at the bottom, and that's when it's backing up. And uh, I'll show you what that does. See, there's a line at the bottom. And of course, when I walk away, the line goes away. But if I walk close to the drone, or if I fly the drone close to me in reverse, you're gonna see the line at the bottom of the app. So that's pretty cool. That is obstacle avoidance. Again, never assume that it exists. Always assume that it's not there. And even if it is there, assume that it's broken because you don't want to, you know, that's something that may help if you are if you run into a, a challenging scenario while you're flying, but it's nothing that should ever be depended upon. It's kind of like a parachute. You know, you may, wear an air, you may wear a parachute in an airplane, but it's not something you want to jump out of your airplane and, and use the parachute. <laughs> You know, it's there in case you need it. It may work, it may not, but it's just kind of for peace of mind. But that's what makes the line appear at the bottom of the DJI Fly app and the top of the DJI Fly app, Fly app. Obstacle avoidance. So tell me what you think within the comment section below. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. It's youtube.com forward slash guy and ring that bell icon when you do, and that'll notify you whenever I post another video. And if you're shopping for the Mavic Air 2, Mavic Air 2 accessories, other drones, cameras, expand this video's description and then click the link there and you can find it all. Thanks for your viewership and y'all have a good day. Hey y'all, Captain Irix Guy here. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to subscribe. It's youtube.com forward slash Irix Guy. And ring that bell icon when you do to be notified whenever I post another video. Thanks for your viewership and y'all have a good day.